Alright, for 7, 8, and 9, the instructions state to put the following in standard form. Remember, standard form, that simply put them in exponent order. So, it'd be the highest exponent, then the next highest exponent, then the next highest exponent, so on and so forth. Alright, put them in that order. So, number 7. It's 2x minus 5 cubed. So, it's 2x minus 5 times... 2x minus 5 times 2x minus 5. And we just got to multiply that out. So 2x minus 5. Negative 5 times negative 5 is 25. Negative 5 times 2x is negative 10x. Positive. There we go. Uh, 2x times negative 5 is negative 10x. And 2x times 2x is 4x squared. Then add everything up. That's 4x uh, minus 20x. 4x squared, I'm sorry for my squared, plus 25. Okay, that's the first bit. Well, then you got to multiply it by 2x minus 5 again. And if you run out of room, just rewrite it over here. But I got the room because I can zoom in. So, again, 2x minus 5. 2x minus 5. Negative 5 times 25 is negative 125. Negative 5 times 20 is positive 100. So that's plus 100x. Negative 5 times 4 is negative 20x squared. All right, then do the 2x. Uh, 2x times 25 is 50x. 2x times negative 20 is negative 40. 50x squared. And 2x times 4 is 8, so 8x cubed. And if I add everything up, in standard form, this would be 8x cubed minus 60x squared plus 150x. Let's clean up that 50 there we go, minus 125. And that would be your answer in standard form. Number 8 follows the exact same pattern. Okay? Um, take the x minus 4 and I'm going to put it right there. x minus 4. And just multiply them out. Uh, negative 5 times 4 is negative 20. Negative 5 times negative 2 is positive 4, positive 10. Not positive 4, positive 10. Negative 5 times 3 is negative 15 and you got drag down your x squared. All right, x times 4 is 4x. x times negative 2x is negative 2x squared and x times negative 3x squared, x times 3x squared, I'm sorry, is 3x cubed. And then add everything up. 15, 17, 14. This is actually one of those cases where we put the harder question first. So what? It's what it is. Uh, last but not least, let me scroll down. We can do number nine real quick. Number nine. Uh, number nine, we're just adding this polynomial. So normally you can just add a polynomial, no problems, no problems. But this one, we're actually subtracting. So because we're subtracting, we need to flip all the signs on the right. So that's now a negative 8x cubed, negative 2x squared, positive 5x, and positive 1. Now we're adding and just can just combine our terms. So we'll start with the x cubed. 4x cubed and 8x cubed make 12x cubed. 6x squared and negative 2x squared make 4x squared. Negative 9x and positive 5x make negative 4x. And then 1 plus 1 is 2. Dun, 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 dun. There you go. Easy peasy.